this is a winter camp that is run by the Department of Public Works and Infrastructure. It is one of the many interventions that we undertake from a capacitation perspective. This winter camp is running from the 29th of June until the 6th of July 2024 and we have brought 22 schools um, here with 139 scholars and 44 educators. The aim of the intervention is to be able to assist uh, the scholars to improve in relation to their mathematics and their science. And so the scholars that we have here today are between the grades of 10 to 12. And also during the camp, we will have universities and we've already had the University of Pretoria that came through uh, to be able to assist the learners on Sunday evening in applying for the various um, uh, spots with, at uh, university for further study next year within the built environment. I'm enrolled for my third year in the University of Pretoria for Mechanical Engineering. Our contribution today here is to offer assistance to the learners, give them an overview and an idea of what university is all about and how, it's, how they should go about the journey of university with the buzzer as well and also to give our testimonies about the program. Here I get a family, friends, I'm exposed to a whole lot of other people who would be of aid to me. It's been three years now since I've been in the buzzery. Um, I've gotten to be the, uh, a buddy member. I'm now student coordinator for beneficiaries who study in the University of Pretoria. One of the learners was testifying that uh, she was able to move from a 72% achievement in these subjects to over 92%. And she was actually saying that because of the network of students uh, that she's now exposed to, she's able to phone up students that have been able to achieve even 100%. So the camp allows for students from various backgrounds, particularly schools that are the poorest of schools within South Africa, which is quintiles one to three, uh, predominantly to, um, to participate in our school adoption program. They then uh, come through and as mentioned, they get the maths and the science intervention, but it is more than that. It is an ability for students to be able to engage uh, with one another, to build friendships, to build support networks. I started this program back in 2022 when I was doing grade 10. I am doing maths and physics. I attend maths and physics here and it has helped me to boost my marks. My physics and maths marks are so high um, because of public works because it gives us the opportunity to ask questions and all that because we don't get the much opportunity at school because we are too many. Um, and also uh, it has helped me to gain confidence the body members, they has helped us gain confidence and this program has exposed me to many careers around the engineering field um, and, uh, and I see myself being an engineer one day because of public works. It's also guaranteeing a bursary already so it's such a great opportunity. I'm so privileged to be chosen to be one of the learners who attend the program. This is my second year at the winter school camp. It's really exciting since I've been here. My grades have improving Good. I can't imagine how my grades would have looked if I didn't attend this camp and I really hope and I want to thank the Department of Public Works and Infrastructure for this opportunity. You also have the teachers at the same time receiving uh, capacitation in relation to various topical issues and UNISA specifically comes in and supports disabilities and the abused learners. The winter camp is part of the school's program that we have. It started in 2013. We've managed to cover more than 38 districts thus far with regard to the school's program. Being here in this particular week, 2024, we've heard of people that have come through the program. This is an investment for many, many years.